welcome back to Dancing with Mr. Allen. Today I'm going to teach you how to wave. I'm sure you guys already know what waving is and you see it all the time, but I'm actually going to show you the technique that goes into waving so that way your waves look more fluid. Okay, so we're going to start off by learning how to isolate different joints in our arms. So we're going to go shoulder, elbow, wrist, and then roll your fingers out, okay? So let's do that. Shoulder, elbow, wrist, and roll. Ready, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Okay, let's try it a little faster now. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Again, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Now we're going to try to do it with our arm up, so that way we can create a perfect wave from one end to the other. But we're starting off with one arm, so remember we're going to do shoulder, and you kind of want to dig that into your ear, and then you're going to do elbow, to wrist, to fingers. So we're, we're coming out with this. So it's going to be shoulder, elbow, wrist, finger. This part might be a little awkward, you might have to lean a little bit, it's okay if you do, but the goal is to stand straight and isolate this shoulder to come closer to your ear. So as we're isolating that, we're gonna isolate the rest of our body. So bringing our elbow up and then wrist and then roll your fingers out. And it's gonna feel awkward at first and it might even uh, cause your arms to be sore, but that's good. You're gaining muscle and you're gaining um, strength. So. By then, all the practice will just become muscle memory. So let's try it. Shoulder, elbow, wrist, fingers. Five, six, seven, eight, starting one, two, three, four. Again, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four. All right, let's try it a little faster now. Ready, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four. Again, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four. Awesome, all right, we're gonna do it faster now. Ready, five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. Good job, guys. Make sure to roll out your arms, wave them out, because I'm already starting to feel it in my arms. All right, so now we're gonna practice all that onto our other arm. Again, starting with your shoulder to elbow, wrist, and you roll your fingers out. Ready, let's do this. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. 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 Five, six, seven, eight. All right, we're gonna try that faster now. Ready? Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now let's try it with our arm up. Ready? Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. All right, let's do it one more time, faster now. Ready, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. Awesome job, you guys. So putting all of that together, your wave should look like this, so it's going outwards. Let's practice that all together now with counts. We're gonna do both shoulders all the way out to your hands. Ready, 
five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Awesome. Okay, guys, now get ready because we're going to do it really fast. Ready? Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. So now you guys know how to wave out, but now I'm going to teach you how to make one continuous wave. So to make a continuous wave, instead of starting at both your shoulders, you want to start off from one hand to go all the way to the other. We're going to break it down to each joint, just like we did with our shoulders. All right, to break that down, we're going to roll up with our hand to go one, break at your wrist for two, elbow three, shoulder four, other shoulder five, elbow at six, seven at wrist, roll for eight. So slowly that looks like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, we're gonna try that a couple times slowly with counts, but we're gonna go wave to this end to bring it to that end and one more time here. Okay, follow along. Here we go guys. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so we're gonna put it all together, but we're gonna go fast. Ready, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So just to recap, if you wanna make your wave look fluid, you have to remember to keep each joint in its position. This is called fixed points. And once you have that down, it'll look 10 times better. So to review everything that we just learned, let's wave out for an eight count, and then let's wave forward and back for one eight count. Ready, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good work, guys. Now all you have to do is practice. As long as you keep practicing and you remember those fixed points, your waves are gonna look masterful and fluid and you can show it off to anyone of your friends. Um, just remember to comment, like, subscribe, send us a video of your progress because I'd like to see it. All right, guys, have a great day. Bye-bye.